Limgrave. So we're off the map. We're on an area we haven't been to before. We are off the map right now. Huh? What do you got? Oh, dear. You might... I... Terribly sorry. Uh, are you here as a customer? What are you selling? Short sword. Bandit mask. Flame chariots. He's selling a halberd. Check it out, dude. A halberd? That's sick. I like the halberd. Cool. All right. I don't know if I really want anything. Cookbook. Increases crafting repertoire. Maybe we should buy this. Sure. Give me the. Give me that. Why not? We can also sell stuff to him. Oh wait. I'm afraid of. All right. What? So what is? Do I have to use it, or do I just have it? I also have no idea how to craft yet. I have no idea how we're supposed to craft. So. Turtle. So we're totally off the map, just exploring here now. There's a big tower we could head in that direction. There's no mistake, is there? Death has left its mark once again. Turtle murder? I tried jumping on the turtles already. I'm known as D. I hunt down those who live in death and weed their death route. Heed my warning. The village here has subscription. Ah, uh, Yasserin, thank you for the 38 months. He's home to a mariner. If you value the village here, turn back. He's telling me to turn back while I can, which means we are definitely going in this direction. Uh, thank you, Yasserin. I really appreciate the 38 months. Yeah, so far everything has been uh stream has been running fine. Uh oh boy, what is that? Stream has been fine since earlier. We had some drops during Dark Souls 1. Is that a fucking boat? Oh shit. What is that? Summon Water Village. Yeah, we're way off the map here. <laughs> okay. More mushrooms. Uh, I pissed something off. Everything is a boss that's going to kick my ass. <laughs> he just hit me with a paddle. He's throwing water at me. Everywhere I go, I get my ass kicked. <laughs> Everywhere I go, I get my ass kicked. Where'd the boat go? There's the boat. 
Everywhere I go, I get my ass whooped. <laughs> I like the music. Oh, that's exactly what I want. That's exactly what I want. Okay. Yeah. Is he healing? So he's gonna be around here somewhere and I have to go like run and find him every time he like warps. Okay, okay. Uh, that looks like he's gonna explode. Damn his stupid ads. Hit me right through the boat. I've got nothing to heal myself either. I think he got me. Man. Ah, I think he got me. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a boat. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a cunt. I thought I had him. I thought I had him. He wore me down. Yeah. Oh, man. Gambit, thank you for the 1,000 bits. Man, have I found a nearby thing? Have I found... I didn't know if I found a nearby thing. Man, bummer. Cool boss. Pretty cool boss. Yeah, it's a pretty cool boss for sure. Hmm. Yeah, this is the closest one I found. The man in his boat. Let's go and use all these. I want to level up. Everything is is a boss in this game. I run into a lot of bosses, and they all kick my ass. <laughs> a lot of bosses, and they all kick my ass. All right. 
If we do something on screen, do you want to hear about it? I'm trying to play without too much like interference, like totally blind. But, uh, you know, use your best judgment. You're not going to get banned or something. You're not going to get banned or anything. All right. I want to see if I can find one of the closer thingies. What's the spear weapon art? It's uh, like this impale thing. I think it probably does more damage. I could try it against him. I, I haven't used it much. I, I only was just recently got the spear, so. Uh, oh my God. Skyliner, thank you for the 10 months. Thank you, Skyliner. Oh, is that? Oh, that might be what I'm looking for here. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder how the, uh, maybe we should try the horse versus this boss. Maybe that would be good. It seems like it might be hard to stay close to him, though. So I don't know if I want to use the horse here. Okay, so this is the closer grace. Uh, Pow Powike. Thank you for the six months. Thank you, Powike. Come here, you boat riding motherfucker. I wonder if I could have uh, done like uh, a critical attack there. Ricola. Where is this boat riding son of a bitch? Enemy felled. Okay. Hey, death roots. Uh, what is it's a? Oh, is this like a key? It's a key item. Huh. Okay. Uh, what is the? This is their first key item. Contain container required for cooking cracked pots. Beast clergyman seeks and devour these. I, I don't know. I don't know, man. <laughs> no idea. I wonder, do you guys think if we go back and talk to that one guy, he's going to say something different, maybe? Uh, Joey Kupo, thank you for the 45 months. Odizi, thank you for the 39 months. Slayer Dan, thank you for 10 months. Powike, thank you for the reset. Thank you, guys. 
Whoa, check it out, dude. Oh, man. I don't, oh, check it out. I don't have a key. No, dude. Oh my God. Okay, all right. The exploration of this game and like keys and holes everywhere to check out and bosses just randomly being in weird ass spots. Really, really cool exploration. What the fuck? When did I get the fucking Florida? Subbing spree. This game is very, very, very cool. Uh, hot, hot take here. Guys, I think Elden Ring is pretty good. <laughs> I like the boat boss. It definitely felt like a play on stuff they've done in the past with like Nito and uh, bosses like that summon other enemies and like, you know. He reminded me a lot of Nito, especially with the fact that his attacks were killing the skeletons, too. How could you say something so brave? <laughs> uh, Corking, thank you for very, very much for the five gift subs. Thank you, Corking. Let's see what's over here. Anything over here? Stop looking at my hole. Subbing spree. Uh, Kirby Fastball. Thank you for the gift sub. Greatly appreciate that. Thank you so much. Uh, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. It really looks like, you know, a lot of games. I I enjoy the lack. Like, it's there's not really too much guidance. They mostly just kind of tell you. They Like, it kind of reminds me of Breath of the Wild, where they like, they give you like Subbing a very spree. basic idea of what to do. And they're like, okay, have at it. Be my guest. Kind of reminds me a little bit of the Breath of the Wild opening. And I, I think that's a really good thing because I think the way Breath of the Wild just throws you right in is one of the strongest aspects of the game. It definitely reminds me a lot of that. Uh, and Tropic, thank you very much. Like They give you like a bare modicum of guidance. Like I think in, in Breath of the Wild, it's like, hey, you should go get the Divine Beast and go that way, but do whatever you want. Bye. This game is like, oh, okay, go this way, but you know, do whatever you want, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not treating the player like a dumb idiot and letting the player do what they want. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> and I strike, and I strike, and I strike, and I strike. Moves on you, lady. Bro, when they jump at you, it's like terrifying. <laughs> Seven, three. So far, we found two enemies that do that. when you heal in this game they all know when you heal they all know they like oh he's about to heal they fucking know in this game they fucking know god they know they know every enemy knows when you heal they all know oh hey look it's our it's our friend dude A singular what, dude can we talk This is our friend guy. Another fool who won't listen to reason, eh? But with a prowess for weeding death root. Hmm. How would you like to earn the strength of beasts? Did I beat Horizon? Yes. To hunt more of those who live in death and weed there. Then I'll introduce you to God. I have a matter of my own, and the beast himself wishes for someone to take my place. What say you? Accept introduction. Very well, I've marked the location for it. Will lead you to Garank. The beast clergyman. A red mark was made on your map. Sending gate. He said he made a map, uh, a thing on our map for Garak the clergyman or something. 
Does anybody see, I'm colorblind. Does anybody see a red mark? <laughs> I don't see it. Is this it? Is, it? is this it? The sending gate? Oh, okay. Yeah, I can't. I'm colorblind. <laughs> Got you. Oh, damn it. I always hit the left stick in to run. Stalin Agnostic, thank you for the five gift subs. Thank you so much. Uh, Entropic, thank you for the gift sub. Kirby, thanks for the gift sub. Killa Hearse, thank you for the two months. Thank you guys very much. Really appreciate that. Thanks, guys. Hope you guys are enjoying the stream. Guys, I think I might be the only person on Twitch right now streaming Elden Ring. Is there a uh, colorblind mode? Not that I'm aware of. I think I might be the only one. It's crazy. You think more people be into be streaming this game, right? So I, I don't want to know. It's possible that this knowledge is known. Um, I don't I don't want to know. I wonder how many bosses there are. Um, uh oh. Bro, you do so much damage. That does like ludicrous damage, man. Corbin, thank you for the 14 months. She does so much fucking damage, dude. God damn. We get her on the fucking Knicks, like holy shit. She pumped. Excuse me, bad guys. I have got to pump up. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, she fucking knew. She fucking absolutely knows when you're healing. Oh, Darth Roni. Bones, thank you for the 22 months. Thank you, Bones. Man. Like, if I take one hit, I am in a lot of trouble versus her. Like, one hit, and that's... Very scary. So this invasion is just here. What's she doing? Oh man. Use furl calling finger remedy to reveal signs of players from other worlds. Gold signs indicate an ally, red signs indicate an adversary. So wait, does that mean you can so that means you can summon adversaries from other worlds? Sacred Scorpion charm. Okay. We got a bunch of cookbooks and items, so I'm assuming these are... So I still don't understand the crafting system. I don't think it was explained to me yet. I don't think it was explained to me yet. So we're definitely much stronger than we were. That's for sure. We've leveled up. I don't remember what level we were when we started, but we're now level 18 or so. 
maybe we just haven't found the crafting system yet. Like maybe like maybe after you beat fuckhead, you know, the slowest attacks in the goddamn universe. Maybe then he's like, oh, well, I see you've learned the craft. Well, yeah. Well, oh, do we start? We started at level one. That's right. <laughs> so we leveled up quite a bit. Can I use the flail? Uh, the flail required 18 decks, which is a lot of fucking decks. A lot of decks. Okay, so let, where are we on the map? So down here is where this gate is that the guy was telling me about. He said, what was it? Like furry the beast man or something or other? Whoa, look at this shit, dude. Look at this shit. Oh boy. Uh, whatever. Oh, this is not good. These guys are cool. I have no idea what that status effect is. I have no idea what that is. We got like in the spear move sec. I, I like the L2 on the spear. Definitely like the L2 on the spear. Suicide. There's a lot of these spear guys over here. Did he fucking stab through his own body to hit me? Is that what that motherfucker did? Did he stab through his own body? Oh my god. Okay, we are gonna fucking eat shit if we keep going this way. <laughs> I really like the uh, spectral horse that just arrives out of nowhere. Like that, that's cool. Look, we found another variety of dog. I didn't realize that. If you hit uh, LB, you attack on the other side. I did not realize that's how it worked. So sometimes horseback fighting feels awful. Like it's like you shouldn't be fighting on horseback against certain enemies. That makes that honestly makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, Matt Smith, thank you for the seven months. Thank you, Matt Smith. Honestly, that makes sense. Some enemies, if you're trying to fight them on foot and they're on horseback, like you're going to get fucking destroyed. And some enemies, uh, if you're on horseback trying to fight them on foot, you're going to get destroyed. So the dog really fucked me up there. His golden army is unvanquished and unbowed, yet finds grace lost, tattered, and faded. Okay. Uh, it's, it's a little weird fighting from horseback. It's a little strange, I would say. Uh, I haven't got used to it. I don't really have an opinion on it other than I feel like I'm bad at it. That's the only thing I feel. Maybe we should try a uh, big dickhead in the castle. What do you think? Should we try the big dickhead again? Or should, maybe we should go toward the sending gate. What do you think? We've got so much stuff to do. I don't, I don't know what to do. I wish we had more smithing stuff to improve the spear. Yeah, I got, we'll go to the sending gate. Let's try that. I don't know what that is. Let's see what that is. So we just want to go south. 
I mean, let's face it. Whatever direction I go, it's going to be a boss and it's going to eat my ass. <laughs> let's face it. That's what it's going to be. Uh, Platinum Platypus, thank you for the six months. Matt Smith, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Hmm. I kind of want to fight these big guys. I bet these big guys have good materials. Like stuff you would want. Like maybe like smithing materials or something. I bet they've got good shit. Uh, I can't look at the map apparently. My ass seems too big with how many people want to eat it. I guess you can't look at the map while you're in combat. Okay, the game considers me in combat, so I can't... I can't look at the map. Okay, there we go. All right, so it's right to the left, right this way somewhere. Okay. Uh, it says we're right on top of it. Travel to another location? Is this what we were looking for? Uh, Pro Sense, thank you for these 20 months. Thank you very much. Um, why can I target that thing? Bro, where the fuck are we? <laughs> Um, you got any rest points here? What do you got? Okay. <laughs> no idea. <laughs> okay, this guy is a friend, it seems. You can't target him. Hand over death root or talk. What does he say? So he says nothing. All right, let's give him the death root. Uh, hand it over. There you go. I smell it. Death. Feed it me. Tarnished. I shall grant thee. Feed me more. Clark, claw mark seal and beast eye i don't know what anything is <laughs> okay said to tremble when close to death so this kind of sounds like a collectible some kind of collectible uh bro we can actually check it out we can strengthen my weapon some more i'm like pretty sure right because we have five Okay, well, let's keep this guy in mind, I suppose. Nern root. Uh, okay. Well. Uh, hi. Hi, I'm just, uh, just passing by. <laughs> just, uh, just, you know, passing by. Black. Whoa! Ah! Ah! Ah!
What does the seal do? What was the item? What item are we talking about here? I think like, unlike... So here's the difference between this and Dark Souls. Unlike Dark Souls, Dark Souls kind of guides you. Like, it's pretty difficult in Dark Souls or Bloodborne or whatever game to end up in an area where you're like, you should not be there. Right now, we've ended up in an area where I think we really shouldn't be. <laughs> I think it's where we have ended up. We are somewhere we absolutely should not be. Uh, Raging Demon, thank you for the seven months. Thank you, Raging Demon. The things here seem pretty angry and mean. Pretty angry and mean. So I think that means we can increase our uh, Estuche some more. And honestly, like, going around here might actually work out if we can snipe, uh, snipe items that, you know, we can find around here. I don't, I don't know what's over here. I have no idea, obviously. That means you can find, yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, maybe we can find, so we already found a thing that increases our flask by one. The only thing that's going to suck here is, uh, everything will probably kill me almost immediately, but... Starlight Shards. I don't know what that is. Sounds good. Looks like you need a manual. Uh, I mean, you can kind of read a lot of the stuff and it will kind of guide you. The item, the item descriptions will help you out a ton. You know what I'm kind of grateful for in this game? I'm kind of grateful for the lack of, like, a, a climbing mechanic. I'm actually kind of glad about that. I feel like every fucking game ever has a... Whoa! Oh, come on, man! <laughs> come on, man! You're breaking my balls here, dude. Uh, flats. Okay, so I don't remember how. Oh, so if I want to get back to the thing, I go here. Okay, that's how you do that. Okay. Why am I so weak? Well, I started off with the weakest class, so that's probably part of it. At least a little bit. Let's see. All right, we can strengthen my spear to plus two. Plus two spear, guys. All right, you know who I'm going for. That bitch going, that bitch going to fight me. How is this compared to Horizon? Uh, they're obviously very different games. Uh, I'm having a ton of fun with this game. I had a ton of fun with Horizon as well, too. These are, so these are all, this inventory stuff is like all explains everything. So this all explains something. The dragon, boost fire negation, boost fire damage. Um, I actually still don't have gauntlets. I'm curious how I will do. I'm curious. So, so to leave here, you just fast travel back. Okay. I want to go this way again. Let's go fight this fucking asshole. Uh, Steve Sobs, thank you very much. How recently did I start playing this? I haven't playing. I haven't been playing this very long. I haven't been playing this too long. I do not understand the crafting yet. Now, I don't understand crafting yet. All right. Uh, I have no souls. Right. Quickly coats arm. Oh, hey, check it out. This drawstring lightning grease is like uh, a gold pine resin. Okay, cool. All right, let's see how we do this time. Come here, motherfucker.
So not a lot of damage. This fight feels like Slave Knight Gale is like the third boss in the game. That's how this fight feels. <laughs> it feels like Slave Knight Gale is the third boss in the game. I'm not going to lie. Reminds me of Pontiff a little bit, yeah. Bits. Hey, Bob. I know you've been having a bad day. Hmm. Thanks for not ending your stream earlier today. Oh, no. You make my shitty situation of having to quarantine away from my wife and newborn much more tolerable. No, dude, I've had a, I've, I've had a great day. Um, thank you very much, Ghost Phoenix. I hope you're feeling better soon. Sorry about your quarantining. He sure does like the dodge. The sidearm is a real, yeah, PB is the hammer. Um, we did okay uh, just an attempt ago. I mean, obviously, it's making a huge difference, the fact that I've upgraded my weapon and I've leveled up a little bit, but yeah, I'm, I'm still kind of getting my ass kicked. <laughs> still kind of getting my ass kicked. Bro, asshole. What an asshole, man. You couldn't just let me heal from that side after all that space I gave it? Bro, look at him every time I heal, he throws. Fuck you, man. dead. I'm 
I'm so dead. Oh, man, this guy's a real asshole. Man, he dodges. He dodges everything. He dodges so much. He li he really does dodge so much. He dodges so much. You miss so many attacks versus this guy, man. Fucking hey. Can you cut off his tail? I don't know if this game has tail cuts. I don't think so. I don't think so. Dude, you ha you heal. You heal and the dagger comes out instantly and hits you. Instantly. Would some range stuff help? Uh, me fumbling for an arrow Selling would really spree. not help. Me fumbling for like, oh, let me find my arrows. I really think that a lot of this boss is just learning it and getting better as a lot of souls bosses are. The moment I attack, he's going to attack. Hate that dodge. Ah, uh, thank you for the gift sub. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. All right. I'm gonna press X. He's gonna do it. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> delay on these attacks. <sighs> I think we got to come back again, man. I think we got to come our I think we got to come back a little bit better now. We're a little bit better, but I think we got to come back, dude. <laughs> Never more exploring. Yeah, we're getting him down better. We've gotten better at the fight, but yeah. Plus 2 spears not enough. It's uh it's rough. So, we could go back this way. Let's go to the stranded graveyard. Let's go southeast. I'll be back, motherfucker. I'll be back. Yeah, yeah, there's still so much to explore. Absolutely. Uh, oh. Uh, how do I... Um, oh. Pull the lever. Oh, it's Y to pull the lever. Where's my soul? My PC can't run this game. I'm sorry, man. Give it time. You'll get it. Dude, the moment you heal versus I love I love seeing it. You'll he'll just be circling you, point he'll just be circling you peacefully. The moment you press X, the dagger comes out. That shit makes me that that makes me so happy. <laughs> I don't know why. It makes me so happy. I love it. Alright, so we're going. Is that, is that strange? Is it strange that I love it and I'm getting uh, I'm dying repeatedly? 
<laughs> is that strange? The moment you do it, it comes out. I'm strange. Man. How am I supposed to... I'm not doing a lot of is jumping attacks. Maybe I need to do them more. You know what these things remind me of? These things remind me of the fucking the wing god of war bats. Those things were fucking assholes too. Oh, some a little bit of chop there. That wasn't my stream. That was the game. I don't think I've actually. I, I don't want to. I don't want to jinx it. But I don't think I've dropped any frames for a while. Oh, dude, I'm having a great time. I. I think the the thing I the strongest thing I can say in favor of this game right now is that every direction I go, I find something like, whoa, what the fuck? Holy shit, what is this? Like, fucking, like, everywhere I go is something like, holy fuck. Like, what am I looking at? There's also, like, all kinds of mysteries, too. A little, a little choppy here, too. Like, uh, we keep finding, like, caves, like, holes in the ground. That, and, like, you know, key, you need a key for this area. Like, we keep finding all this cool shit. Uh, it's, it's been a ton of fun. It's been a ton of fun so far. I won't, like... I, I, it's still early. I'm not gonna. I can't give you like a really strong opinion on like how the game and all the mechanics and stuff. But I'm having a really fun time. I'm gonna feel bad killing these guys. And I don't feel bad killing the dogs. So in a backstab, you're like Omega Invincible. Okay. Can you jump in many Souls games? Uh, you can jump in Sekiro, and that's pretty much it. Yeah. Oh, well, technically you can jump in, in all of the Souls games. Um... But jumping in those games is, uh, yeah, not particularly good. It's not the games are the strongest. Holy shit. Ah, uh, that guy, KP, thank you very, very much for 10 gifts of rat, rat. It's a Dark Souls rat. Uh, that guy, KP, thank you so much for the 10 gift subs. Flesh. Oh, we found another key. Oh, shit. We found a key, guys. Uh, thank you so much. That guy, KP, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Sebastian, thank you for the 20, 34 months. Uh, Flesh Sickles, thank you for the gift subs. Thank you so much, guys. I really, really appreciate it. I hope you guys are enjoying the stream today. Uh, I know I am having a great time having a great time. Hope you guys are enjoying it as well uh, We are gonna be going still for uh, a while We're gonna be streaming for a while So if you were looking for a much much you're looking for a long boy stream This is gonna be it Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I found the Royal Rat Authority here. Should have taken two weeks off for Eldering. That's what freaking Hod did. Two weeks off of your job for a video game. <laughs> Does a story matter? I can't say I really know what's happening. Um, 
Ensnared in a transporter trap? I don't like I don't like how long it's taken to load. <laughs> I don't like how long that's taken to load. Celia Crystal Tunnel. What the fuck in the mama? Gravity Stone fan? Gravity Stone chunk? Are these for upgrades? Oh, these guys. Holy fuck. Where am I? Ah! Is that guy a fucking silverfish? Take the materials. I can die, but the materials are forever. I'm taking your materials. Goodbye. Just running in and robbing them. Any more guys coming? Well, these guys seem incredibly easy to backstab. They remind me of the crystal dudes from uh, Dark Souls 1. You get a ranged weapon in these games? I have a bow. I haven't tried bows in this game. Uh, typically, bows are not good. Or at least they are situational and you need them in certain like areas or something, but it's kind of hard to play uh, Dark Souls and go just with bows. It's pretty hard to do that. Now as a supplement, no problem. Okay, what is this thing alive? I can target this thing. That's not good. Uh, can I go, hang on, let's go rest real quick. Oh, I can target all of these things. Okay. Bloodborne area. Whoops, I did not mean to pass time. So there's also the night and day cycle in the game. There's also like a day and night cycle. I wonder... Um, do certain events in certain areas happen based on certain times? So this is where we ended up, by the way, because of that teleporter. <laughs> That's where we ended up. And, uh, I don't know. We're suddenly in a fucking oblivion gate, apparently. Uh... Poke it with a stick. Okay, I didn't do that. I'm sorry. I'm leaving. <laughs> I apologize. I'm out of here. <laughs> uh, this. Oh, good. We found the poison swamp. What is the point of this, like, footstep thing?
What the fuck is this? Like a super dumb one is this shit? Hey, come here. Okay, I don't have not nearly enough damage to kill that thing, apparently. Nowhere near enough damage to kill that thing. Uh... I'm gonna die to this fucking Scarlet Rod is what's gonna happen. And the situ situation has not improved. Streets of Sage's Ruins. Okay, well, that's it. If I don't find a thing here, I'm gonna be big trouble. I guess we got a ton of upgrade materials, so that's kind of good. Uh, I think we just found a set of clothing. Subscription. And we died. Well, I got the meteorite staff, apparently, and we died. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, interesting. Okay. Uh, steak of... So there's a steak of Marika? I think let, let's get out of that area. I don't know if we want to be all the way over there. That seems like an area where we should not be. It seems like an area we shouldn't be. This is how you play Breath of the Wild. Yeah, I don't think it really mattered much anyway. Uh, all right, so I've got a couple of souls, not much. A small number of runes. Uh, what about my materials that I just got? Let's see. Smithing stone, uh, or reinforced armaments to plus three. So. That is like a, ch that's like a large shard, I think. And then this is like a small shard. I'm pretty sure is how that all works. Uh, let's see. We have some gloves. Let's go put these gloves on. Um, so I've got medium load according to the game. You got a new hat. Dude, check out my new hat. <laughs> I like my new hat. I like it. Uh, Schnuffle Kitty, thank you for the 19 months. Thank you, Schnuffle. Ghost Stars, thank you for 18 months. Van Man, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, well, uh, I think I, I keep... Let's go here. So I can only travel to a place I've been. Okay, let's go here then. Only been Only to a place I've been. I cannot travel from here? I can't travel from here. Okay, well. What's the size of the map? Uh, fucking big. That is the size of the map. Fucking big. We're gonna have to find our way out of here, it looks like. Uh, Steve, thank you for the four months. Thank you, Steve. If we keep going west, that's kind of back in the realm of, like, areas we probably want to be. Yeah. Yeah. Can't kill that guy fast enough. Uh, fun dumpster. Thank you very much. Will the status effect hit your horse? Well, I guess because my horse is dead or like spectral, the status effect doesn't affect my horse. So that's good. Toxic mushroom. Yeah, that's good. bad look at my horse my horse is amazing
Yeesh. I'm really curious about the magic in the game. Like the spells. Really curious about that too. Ooh, what is this? Your splendid blade dancing amidst the scarlet rot. Is that what you wanted? Uh, well, I don't really know what this guy wants. Okay, well. Oh, hey, check it out. Yeah, I'm really curious about it. I'm really curious. Is this a new swamp area? Yeah, so we found two poison swamps in the past, like, 15 seconds. Show you where the lemonade. So many. I know there's so many mysteries. Isn't that amazing? I love the mysteries. I love the figuring it out. That's my favorite. I love that so much. That is just the absolute best. Yeah, this is our second poison swamp I think we found. So we're still kind of going west, I guess. Kalid. Traveling salesman? How long until one of these traveling salesmen ambushes me? Okay, what does he got? Poison stone. Throw in enemies to cause a buildup of poison. Ooh, wow. Check it out. You can throw these to poison somebody. Can I sell anything? Uses FP to emit fan shaped gravitational shock wave. Material used for crafting items. Grants the blessing of an equipped rune upon use. I don't know what that means. Used to, I don't know what anything means. Temporarily boosts physical attack. Uh, coats armament inflicting scarlet rots. This one gives me 1600. Oh, so I can sell these crap. I can sell my crafting materials too. Um, cracked crystal. Bolstering materials. Wait. Lord Sorn straight sword? Oh, I guess I have that. Interesting. I guess it's just a weapon I have. When did I get this weapon? When did I get it? 115 plus 16 attack. About an hour ago. Maybe I should upgrade this. This this weapon seems good. Mercenary said the staff is a catalyst. All right, man. Sorry, dude. I don't think I want anything. Let me see this. Uh, we haven't looked at the sword, right? Let's see the sword. Feels very uh very Dark Souls three. Whoops. Uh, hang on. I keep forgetting the two hand. Square off. Oh, that's so Dark Souls 3. <laughs> that is Omega Dark Souls 3. Okay, cool. Dancing with the sword. That is very, very Dark Souls 3 right there. He'll starve. Uh, I, I missed the part where that's my problem. Can you kill the merchants? Probably, yeah. How you turn out weapons? You have to hold Y and hit RB. Then you can do it back like this. It's a little weird. A little weird. Okay, so we're going southwest. Did I make a bingo card? I did not. General southwesterly direction. I'm still in combat. Okay, LB on the horse attacks to the left, loser. and RB attacks on the right. You can also do the weapon art on the or the heavy attack on the left and right as well too. 
I was. I thought it was strange you can only attack from one side. Uh, Abyssal Prox, thank you very, very much for the tier two 36 months. What are these starlight shards? I don't know what they are. They let you like equip a rune or something, but I don't know. Bingo car would have been fun. Uh, there's a big ocean here. So there's like a huge, check it out. So there's like a huge lake here and we're on the other side of the lake and we're trying to get back to like this region. Okay. Yeah, there was something that like replenishes my FP or something or other. I don't really care too much about that. Um, all right, so we got to go north around the river and then west. I mean, I figure we may as well just keep going, right? And look around. There's a, look at that, there's another big castle up here. Now, Lord only knows what's waiting for me here. Kaled Waypoint Ruins. Oh man, those silverfish guys, they are strong as fuck, dude. They have a lot of HP. Is this uh is this a way to upgrade my flask here? Is that what this is? What is this? This is like a rune where somebody died or something. Oh, look, check it out. This guy's like leading me somewhere. What class did I go with? Uh, I went with uh, the worst class, the wretch. I went with wretch. Because I am a smart person. <laughs> I went with wretch. Where's he taking me? There he is. Is that where he's leading me? A singular strike. Sure looks like it. Oh, man. I have a key. I have a key. I could open this. I have a key. What? Yeah, whatever it's going to be, though. Use it. Yeah, go ahead. You need two. You need two. Oh, my God. You need two of them. Oh. I'm so disappointed. <laughs> you need two. It says not enough. I am so disappointed. <laughs> uh, my disappointment is immeasurable. Yeah, they sold one, but I'm kind of desperate for any souls I can get right now. So, because I need to level up so I can beat fuckhead. Uh, I need to level up as much as I can. Mm, are we here? Fwend? You got a fwend. Fwend, people happy. What are you about a hundred? Yeah, we're shy. We're the thing I think I think the thing I need the most right now is damage on my weapon, but levels would also help. Show hands. Oh, bless you. Oh. Oh. Are 
you to the south. A grand festival to make the stars turn to the east. The hardened bud of a flower to be. <laughs> So I feel like she's telling me about an area. It's like a rumor, kind of. She's like, tell me about rumored areas on the map. Okay. You remember chocolate? You always hated it? Something about Scarlet? Yeah, it's kind of where we just came from, right? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, oh, I don't like that. Did Orator's head just breathe fire on me and run me over? Is that what just happened? Is that, is that fucking Orator's head? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> is that what that was? What in the twisted metal? This is some fucking Neo enemy design right here, dude. <laughs> that is some fucking Neo shit. Uh, bye. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not gonna deal. I'm good, man. You're on your own there. Uh, another... What in the holy shit, man? We're in scary fucking area, dude. Holy shit. What is that? Look at that shit. Thank God for Epona. Uh, let's level up. More life, please. <laughs> oh, you thought dogs were bad. That thing is horrifying. <laughs> that thing is horrifying, dude. Do I have a death tracker? No, I, I'm not keeping track. That thing is horrifying. Oh, we killed one. <laughs> oh, we killed one. Basically killed us, but we killed it. Uh, all right, let's take a look at the map here. Yeah, not a lot. We're still trying to go south, west and south. West and south. 
Huh? Welcome to Jurassic Park. Yeah, man, definitely some uh, some very fantastical enemy and boss design and stuff, but uh, very cool. Very, very cool. Maybe the giant head wagon is a little over the top for me, but uh, very cool. Bro, fuck this area, dude. What is this fucking area? Get me out of here. Was that uh, four smithing stones we just got? Did we just get four smithing stones? Bro! Okay, west. Or was it a level four stone? I, I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Ah, uh, you got the standard Dark Souls piece of poop enemies. Oh, there's a lot of, this is a lot of souls over here, huh? Okay, there's like a graveyard and we just like rob the graveyard, I guess. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's a big world and uh, it's a big terrifying open world with a lot of horrific enemies involved. There's been some cool stuff for so far. Ah, uh, man, that boat boss though, the boat boss was pretty fucking sick. That was a cool one for sure. Boater from Dark Souls 2. George R. R. Martin designed the tank mini boss. You think so? Nascent butterfly. I kind of wish when you picked up an item for the first time, it like showed it to you, like told you what it is. Material used for crafting item. It's an exceedingly rare to find. Okay. Seems good. Oh yeah. That wandering boss guy. That guy was cool too, for sure. Just like in Dark Souls, those things are horrible. Maybe sell for a lot. Yeah, if it's a crafting material, I might be nervous to sell it. Is there a door to the house? It's like a barn. Any more any any whoa they fun they tried to throw in the ambush at me okay breath of the wild did that when you first picked it up do breath of the wild does that for like every fucking crappy like goblin guts and this and that breath of the wild does it for like everything Shack of the Rotting. Why does there need to be a name for the Shack of the Rotting exactly? Why? Why does the Shack need a name? That's suspicious. Bro, there's got to be secret walls in this game and shit. Like, why can you jump up here, right? Why, why can you do this if there's nothing here? Hmm. Huh? Baby love shack. It's love shack. There are, I saw it. There's gotta be. Oh, what does this thing say? Let's talk to this thing. It's rotting. Everything rotting scarlet. The very earth that Caleb rests upon. The end is nigh for us all. Okay. Mm Let's uh, keep going, Wes. You're struggling so hard in this game right now. That's normal for most first time souls playthroughs. That's totally normal. 
And when you're no longer struggling, you will miss when you were struggling and you're like, man, wish I could go back. Wish I could get that back. So I wish I could, it's weird. I can't open the map sometimes when I feel like I should be able to. Just wanted to look at the map. Okay, no map, I guess. You can only play it for, you can only be lost and shitty and terrible at the game like once. And then afterwards you'll remember stuff and then you, you, you will miss that experience. I'm so, dude, I'm so excited when I find caves. When I find a cave, I'm so happy. What is this? Okay, now we can look at the map. Okay, who, God only knows where the fuck we're going. <laughs> only Miyazaki knows. Gale Tunnel. We, this isn't where we were before, was it? This is a different tunnel, right? It's a totally different tunnel. We weren't, we weren't in this one. All right. Go use your mouth and your butt to make money. That's solid advice. That's some Neo shit right there. More smithing stones. Okay. Wait a minute. What? Doesn't open from this side. But there's nowhere to go. Unless I missed a tunnel? Aww. Is this like the way out or something? Aww, I'm bummed. I was excited. I guess the game threw me a bone when it gave me the uh, thing, right? So we're still way off. We still want to go south and west. I think that there is fall damage in the game. I think that there is fall damage, but I think it's not, it's not like it is in Dark Souls. See, we all, all people who have played Dark Souls were like terrified of fall damage. I don't think this game has fall damage like that. I think that it maybe exists, but it's not the same. Maybe think of it more like Sekiro. All Dark Souls players are like terrified of fall damage. Ash of War Sacred Blade. What the fuck is that? What is that? <laughs> what is that? It sounds cool. Usable on melee armaments. Grants affinities and skills. So this is one of the skills you can equip your weapon with when you do it. Okay. What does the red square beneath your stamina indicate? Uh... The red square beneath my stamina. I'm not sure what you're talking about. There. Oh, there's your life. So there's life, FP, and stamina. That's probably what you're talking about. What's in the box? It goes from nothing to dead real quick. I haven't died from a fall yet. I haven't died from a fall just yet. Oh, this is new. What do we got? Sacred tear or tear. Hair or tear? I'm not sure which. Completely ignored the... Oh, that red square? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't even see it. I have no idea, actually. <laughs> you can find crystal tears at the bases of minor erd trees and elsewhere. At sites, you can mix two crystal tears te in the flask. This will allow you to create elixirs with various custom effects. 
Yeah, we're gonna. It's gonna take some time to figure shit out. <laughs> we're gonna. It's gonna take us some time to figure some shit out. Mix wondrous physic. With this, you can combine two crystal tears, a potion. Okay, so we have restores half of total HP in mixed physic. So that's how we could do it. Okay. And that's the only one we have right now, so that's all we can do with it. All right. Like alchemy and shit? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we can make some bloody tears later. All right, still we're going south and west. You know you need a chemistry degree to play Elden Ring? It's still like how I did in chemistry. Just cheat your way through it. That is a fucking big crab. Guys, it is time for crab. Bro, this is like literally the exact Dark Souls 3 crab. <laughs> this is exactly the Dark Souls 3 crab. Excuse me, crab. I'm just going to get hit by literally everything. Okay, we got some flesh and crab eggs. Barb's got crabs confirmed. Afraid not. You kill them? Delicious. Do you guys like crab? You guys crab eaters? You guys are, have you guys ever gotten hungry seeing a cartoon food before? I'm not a big crab guy. Like I'll have crab sushi or whatever. I was watching, there's an episode of Samurai Shampoo where they like have a crab and they put it over a fire and they like roast it. And for some reason that was like, man, that looks delicious. I want to eat a crab. <laughs> Watching that made me fucking hungry for crab. I got hungry from cartoon food. <laughs> Crabs and Barb's ring. We're gone. I'm glad I didn't get sucked bashing my brains out against the boss. That was definitely the dumb decision. Wow, we're going way down. Whoa! What the fuck? Whoa! <laughs> wow. Subscription. Siofria River. Damn. Uh, Morrigan, thank you for the two months. Matthews Twitch, thank you for 31 months. Thank you very much. Spectation, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much, guys. Really appreciate that. Uh dude, imagine if I got here and I turned around immediately. I feel like I feel like people would unfollow. <laughs> I get here and I'm like, whoa, cool. Alright, I'm leaving. <laughs> I would probably I would probably be like, come on, man. I would probably leave the stream. bro you know that scene the scenes in Dragon Ball Z where somebody's powering up and somebody's got the scouter and the scouter's like 
and it gets going and guys like, huh? That's like me with this game. Like I'm watching it, I've got my scouter and I'm like, huh? And the power level just like keeps going up and up and up. Like <laughs> that's, that's me with this game. Like it's like, man, this game is so cool. And then just like, it's just something else just keeps on going, man. Dude, my, I, the first time I played Sekiro, I had such an amazingly good time. Oh, God, what a, what a super fun experience that was. Possibly some similar vibes here. Similar for me. Uh, well, we found enemies. I think something that's going to be cool about watching this game, people play it, is that everybody's going to do, like, wildly different things. <laughs> like, everybody's going to play the game totally. Like, everybody's going to get to the guy. <laughs> almost everybody, either everybody, or almost everybody's going to get their ass kicked by that guy. And then everybody's going to go off in totally different directions and shit. You will pick the hardest way to play it. Yeah, this game is fucking fantastic. It's already it's already pretty fucking fantastic. I don't want to prematurely judge because the game did just come out and I haven't gotten that far in it. We're, we're still baby. We are still babby. Okay, more smithing stones are good. All right, do you guys want to fucking throw down? Okay, I don't do a lot of damage to you guys, but you're very slow. There's a lot of you here. This might be a smash and grab operation here. Where we just run in, grab what we can, and keep on running because fighting these guys looks either suicidal or a waste of time. A rainbow stone. We don't know what that does. What class am I playing? I am a wretch. I am a wretch. Okay, so this area seems really good because there's a ton of smithing stones here for basically free because these enemies are not particularly fast. So this area seems really good. There's also a lot of golden runes. Uh, is this like the exit? Uh, well, I don't want to leave yet. <laughs> what a can you get the horse in here? Oh, you can. You can still get the horse in here, too. Okay. I don't want to leave yet. Uh, I don't know what that did, but sure. I don't want to be a pirate. More uh, budding horn. Can I like platform my way up here? Like what is, look at this. Is there a reason to do this? Yeah, these enemies are almost comically slow. Throwing dagger. Uh, 
question. How? Okay, uh, this may kill me. But I think we got to try it, right? Maybe on the horse. Can I use the horse to cushion the blow, so to speak, here? Okay. Silver pickled foul foot. I th the game is throwing like a bunch of shit at me and I'm like, I don't know what that is. Acquire materials, a golden centipede. Okay. Thanks game. Uh, I think this is back where we were before. Let's go see where the elevator take, takes me. Possibly it's just the exit, but uh, who knows? Dude, ima dude, imagine if it took you further down. I would have lost my mind if it took me further down. <laughs> Long stream, you're still going. Yeah, we're going to be going late. We're going to be going late today. Uh, I'm still, dude, I'm still underground. We haven't, we're not at the surface yet. So this is just another subterranean area. Preserving boluses. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I feel like the, I like that the torch kind of has... I'm glad I bought the torch because I feel like it has some innate uses kind of everywhere. Has a lot of use kind of all over. Beast liver. I can, you can two-hand the shield, apparently. I'm not sure why you would, but you can. Big crab. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna pass on fighting this crab. I stole his eggs. Subscription. Subscription. Crosnock, thank you for the resub. Thank you, Crosnock. How is the difficulty? Uh, it's been challenging so far, but um, you're not supposed to mat. I, I feel like the thing I'll say about this game is that I feel like you're not supposed to mash your brain against an obstacle to knock it down. I feel like you're supposed to go elsewhere, explore somewhere else, level up, come back. Maybe and more so than in any Souls game, you know, like even more so. Other Souls games were always kind of like that, but this one dials that up a lot, I think. It's like, if you were playing Breath of the Wild, would you go straight to Ganon's castle and be like, bro, this game is so hard. This game is bullshit. Like, no, you wouldn't because that's not what you're supposed to do. Who the fuck is that? Oh, who the fuck are you? Oh, who the fuck? I don't like you. Oh, there's a lot of you. There are a lot of you, aren't there? Oh, there's another. Oh, there's another. Oh, there's another. I want to see what this is. Light flame. What does that do? Light the flame! Is this like some kind of Abyss Watchers style thing where we light the flame to open a door?
I think I pooped a little. I think I pooped a little. Katie, get the gamer bucket. What the fuck is... The fuck are you? There's so many of you. Fur calling finger remedy. Ah, uh, That thing is... I, dude, I am so hopelessly lost here, too. <laughs> I'm starting to get Returnal vibes where it's like, man is too confused. I'm starting to get some Returnal vibes right now. This area is huge. This is a huge... I did not like that. Can you enter the waterfall? I don't think so, no. Hundred bits. Thank you, Jimmy. Where am I? So this is some huge. Oh, you know what? Hey, we recognize this, right? I must have ran right past this. Whoa! Check it out. Check it out. Whoa! What do these do? Oh, we found a map. Okay. Damn, dude. Uh. Hollow Horn Grounds. So, are we trying to... I think we're trying to wake this thing up. I feel like that's what we're trying to do. I, 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 that's the, the sense I'm getting here. Wake this thing up for it to kick my ass. This is the general thing I'm getting. Uh, Dark Jester, thank you for the 1,000 bits. Thank you, Dark Jester. I wanted to see if it would wake up. Yeah, so we're underneath the world here and like the tree and shit. You can see like the roots of the castles and stuff going up. It's pretty wild. Feels like game of the year. What really beats this? I mean, it's I haven't finished the game. I mean, you know, it's hard to say, but um, Horizon Forbidden West is also an incredible game. Um, I know that there's probably a lot of people here who are like exclusively Souls fans or FromSoft fans, but uh, I, I do want to stress that Forbidden West was fucking amazing. It was a really, really good game. Uh, what the hell is over here? Trina's Lily. Stout Mantle, thank you for the five gift subs. Thank you very much. 
Oh, I found a bow. Horn bow. Okay. Maybe should I try? Can I even wield these bows? Can I even wield this shit? Mm, I can't wield any of these bows I've gotten. I was curious how it would be. Uh, thank you very much, Stout Mantle. These guys remind me of uh, the enemies in the DLC for Dark Souls 3. The Hornwood and Millwood Knights and shit. Oh, so you can, you can jump again midair. Bits. That looks like one of the things we have to light. This is fucking crazy. This is fucking crazy, dude. Should I come here? I hope I'm okay. So it looks like this area has these waypoints that you toggle, kind of like the swamp in Dark Souls 3. And when you toggle them all, perhaps dwelling arrow, perhaps when you toggle them all, uh, that's when the big guy wakes up. Maybe. Uh, D. Jeffers. Thank you for the 37 months. Thank you, D. Jeffers. It's cool how there's like all the animals from above are down here too. really feel like I didn't have a chance there. I don't think, yeah, I don't think I'm supposed to be here either. I feel like I'm finding this entire day has been me finding places like, yeah, you probably shouldn't be here. <laughs> I feel like that's been a lot of today. Yeah, you probably shouldn't be here. <laughs> Excuse me, coming through. Watch out. Uh, excuse me. Coming through. Arrows in chest. Bad. I'm noticing that the same experience you had a Friday for the West Virginia. You seem to be enjoying it more. Uh, I think death is cheaper in Souls and FromSoft games where, you know, you kind of expect to die a lot more. Okay, we lit a flame. Look at the size of this fucking arrow in me. 
You think this arrow is big enough? I don't I don't know, man. Not big enough for my taste. Maybe a bigger arrow. You got a bigger arrow than that? You call that a fucking arrow? <laughs> Dude, I'm like, I'm gonna walk on, I look like I'm gonna walk on the tightrope with the fucking thing, <laughs> the balancing beam. <laughs> oh man. Three darts is too much. <laughs> okay, so that's definitely, we've kind of figured out what's going on here. We kind of at least understand what's going on. Uh, so far, how am I enjoying this? Well, I'm very early in. This is... Whenever you, people ask about games... Oh, hang on. There's something here, too. You have to remember is that when you ask about games, you're talking about, like, a fucking huge game. This is a big game. So it's going to take me a while. So far, I'm having a really good time. I'm having a really good time. Okay, I don't know where this is taking me. Let's try this, right? If I, so, did that like warp me forward? I think it did. Uh, Zlotpunk, thank you for the 24 months. Thank you, Zlotpunk. Buttery Man, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. I guess we're here, light the flame. I wonder how bullshit this boss is gonna be. So I'm pretty sure I could upgrade my weapon again. Pretty sure. Man, these uh, archers, look at how, do you see how far away that archer was? Did you see how fucking far away the archer was and I still got got? Do you see that? That archer was like a fucking mile away and I got got. You think the graphics look like shit? Mm, are we looking at the same game? I feel like this game has a really good visual style. Like, are we looking at the same game? Wow, those uh, lightning things. I don't like those. I think an important aspect of getting good at this game will be understanding when and how to use the horse. The crabs aren't big enough. Oh man, these fucking things again. When and how to use the horse. Oh my god. Get out of here. I have a ton of golden runes, too. I think around here is where I died to this lightning shit not long ago. Hey, what's up here? Every direction I go in feels like when every direction you go in is shit that is slaughtering you. Maybe you're in the wrong area. Maybe you shouldn't be here. Maybe this is not where we should be right now. 
Perhaps we should go somewhere easier. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm definitely getting that feeling. Definitely getting that feeling, but... That doesn't mean I want to change what I'm doing, though. <laughs> Final boss. Doesn't feel good. I mean, I'm having a good time exploring here. How's the randomizer of this going to be? I mean, I don't know, man. Who knows if this game will even work with a randomizer? Like, I don't know. Like, what do you even need to win? Are there items you need to win? Are there bosses you need to kill? I mean, we don't even know. I don't know, so. These archers are fucking insane. These archers, those enemies are fucking insane. Holy shit, man. Holy fucking shit. Those archers are fucking crazy. Wow. You got the crazy archers that are everywhere. They're hidden. You've got the exploding uh, electric balls. Okay, well we got another one. Of, well, we got another one of the flames. Okay, so that flame we lit. Ah! <laughs> you couldn't hit me. Big rats. Some of these assets look like exactly like Dark Souls assets. Like some of some of them look exactly like them. I'm sure that they're slightly modified. I'm not mad at it. I, I'm not like, oh my god, how dare they? I'm not mad at it, but they look exactly like it. <laughs> I'm not like, I'm not like, oh my god, how dare they? How could they ever have done that? Yeah, I'm not mad at it. For every for every asset, there's like a ton of new stuff, right? So I'm not like, I'm not pissed off, but I'm just simply noticing it. Isn't there something over there? Like, I don't know. Kind of looks like I can I can get over here, right? What's over here? Something? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, <laughs> okay, I maybe, I maybe I'm looking a little hard. Maybe I'm looking a little too hard. <laughs> maybe a little too hard. Ah. 
Dark Souls brain? Yeah, maybe. Uh, I think I, I didn't I didn't count specifically, but I think there's only one or two more torches we have to light, I think. Okay, the double jump on the horse definitely helps a lot. Oh, not this shit again. Wow. These archers are a fucking menace. They are a menace. They don't miss. So wait a minute. So this is another one of these sword, these sword door things. Check it out. And it looks like it's one of them that has two. So if you want to activate the way out of here, you need to have two. That's what it's looking like. Yeah, that's what it's looking like. You need two of those key things to get out of here. Uh, okay. <laughs> I can feel it. I can feel it. We're close to something. I can feel it like it's right in my neck. Run! <laughs> oh, there's only one more somewhere. There's only one more. Where's the last one? I kind of felt like the path, the torches were, you know, guiding me along the path. Uh, so this one I already lit, obviously. I think that this was a dead end. It's possible I ran right by it. There was also that area on top of like the wooden architecture over there and uh, I died trying to get over there. Opinion of the game so far. This is the most fun I've had with the video game since uh, last week when Horizon Forbidden West came out. <laughs> That might not seem like high praise, but that's pretty high praise. Uh, I'm having a I'm having a great great time with this. Having a great time with this. Okay, is this fucking guy going to jump down? Uh, you were asking me an opinion on a book I've, I've read or haven't read. Uh, okay. You want to go down there? That works for me. I don't think I've read that book. Uh, Bry Photo Guy, thank you for the 38 months. Didn't I say I wasn't playing this? I said I wasn't going to play it before it came out. I only got early access. Uh, I got early access last night. So originally I was going to have to wait until 6 p.m. like everybody else. Bro. Bro, I'm sorry. Don't enemies typically stop sometimes? What the fuck was that? What in the fuck? That was bullshit, man. You swing for fucking ever? Okay, we just we're, we the, we just like to swing literally for all fucking eternity. Also, we summon our crab. What are you fucking Joey Wheeler summoning your goddamn bullshit? This is bullshit. I just want to get the item up there, man. Fuck. Swing, 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 pause, swing, 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 swing. God, what are you, what is this shit? What is this shit? Fucking bullshit, man. I just wanted to get that dumb item up there. Uh, I would say we're still so early. Like, I don't know. I guess I could have, instead of exploring and running around like an idiot, I guess I could have tried to like level up and grind or something, but I'm kind of just enjoying just looking around the world. So I, I obviously like, I don't know. I'm not trying to min max and blast through the game as fast as possible. I'm just trying to enjoy myself and, you know, just looking around, seeing what I can find. 
So I kind of turned back from here earlier. Let's keep going this way. That was fucking bullshit, man. Two, like, incredibly tough enemies that never stop swinging. Oh, great. Oh, great. That's just... What a great horse you are. What a beautiful horse you are. Thank you so much. What a great fucking horse you are. Beautiful. I like the way you die. Yeah, there's a double jump. What a great fucking horse. <laughs> oh, man. Rider's fault. Probably, you guys think that the last, the last torch to light is over there along the wind bridge area thing? I feel like if it was anywhere, it'd be there, right? For the record, I am 100% aware that whatever this boss is that wakes up whenever I do this, it is going to eat my ass. It's going to be something even harder than the last fucking, the other thing I can't beat. It's going to be even harder than that. <laughs> it's gonna be it's gonna be even more bullshit than that yeah my ass about to be eight okay so it's like I'm like quasi platforming here the fuck is that <laughs> I'm sorry who the fuck is that hello What are you looking at? The fuck you doing? Hey, what's over there? <laughs> Preview for the GDQ speed run. Now, if I jump my horse against the wall here at just the right angle, we can trigger the credit sequence in uh, 0.56 seconds. A little preview for you. Cheater! <laughs> so, we still... Oh. We're fine. Okay. We still do not know where the last thingy is. Horse is nimble as fuck. Does the horse not have fall damage? Uh, I've had the horse die. The horse has died. And if the horse dies, I also die. Incoming arrows. Yeah. Oh, oh, scary. <laughs> I've just been fucking, I've been getting fucking shredded. I should probably get out of here, but I want to light the last thing, man. I want to light it. I want to light it. Uh, what's up, Missar? Oh, I'm having a really good time. Really enjoying myself so far. Bro, yeah, these archers are fucking crazy, man. They are... They are... They are... They gobs... I'm gobsmacked by these archers. They, uh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> they're crazy. They feel like, uh, they're almost like a hazard, almost like, uh, like the angels or something. Elven train for sure. So, um, I can find this last thing, but we're going to have to make our way out of here. We can fast warp back, but, uh. 
Yeah, we're going to have to get out of here. Can we just take the teleport thing to avoid them. Well, I don't know where I don't know where the thing is, dude. Have you seen it? If I passed it, maybe. That one we lit. I have found a lot of lot of golden runes. Is that it? Is that it? Oh! Light it! Hey! Go ahead, assholes. Go ahead, motherfuckers. Okay. We lit them all. We lit them all. Bro, I'm about to fucking eat ass. I'm about to eat some ass right now. Let's see. We lit all the beacons. Yeah, I think that's all of them. We got to see what this is. Uh, thank you, Irish Orange, for the nine months. Okay, they're all, they all seem lit to me, right? Looks like all of them. Maybe it's a friend. Hippo friend. I lit your torches. Touch horn remains. Can somebody please tell all the protagonists from from soft games that touching something is never a good idea. Somebody please tell every from soft protagonist that touching something is not a good idea. What the fuck is this? <laughs> You're so dead. <laughs> Okay, so you can't summon your horse in this. cool but <laughs> oh wait so there's a stake here so what happens if we go back to the stake is it gonna take me right back into the fight feels slow oh it just takes so there's wow okay so it seems like elden ring has taken steps to eliminate boss runbacks it feels like the game has really taking strides forward to eliminate boss runbacks. The only thing that sucks about this is how hard it is to hit. Feels like a uh, mid-ear. Like some slight mid-ear chasing after mid-ear vibes.
cry. Like, I literally can't hit this fucking thing. <laughs> I'm targeting it. It's not like I'm not targeting it. You really don't want to walk on that shit, apparently. Look at these misses. Like, I'm right on him. Seems like it's a, a pretty difficult boss to actually hit. I gotta say, it's a beautiful fight. The music is great. It's like visually striking. A very, very beautiful. Music especially is very good. Huh? You're a sucker for violins. I think we're going to back out here and I w I've picked up so many upgrade materials. It'd be nice if I could possibly upgrade my weapon some more. Let's go here. We might be able to come back. Try the bow. I can't even use, dude, I can't even use any of my bows. I can't use any of my bows. Feels like a boss you shouldn't target. Very possible. Very possible. Uh, all right. So if we want to get out of here, um, I don't have the key, so I can't do that. Oh, wait. Oh, so you... Oh, can you still travel above ground? Can I still do this? Okay, I can still travel above ground. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, we've got a lot of stuff we can do here, I think. I think we've got a lot of stuff. It's about time we came back. Yeah, you can fast travel. Yeah, you can fast travel. Barb happy? I I am. I am I'm very happy. I'm very, very happy. I went out of my way to not learn anything. Look at how many souls I have, dude. Uh I'm just gonna use them all, I think. I went out of my way to not know anything, avoid everything about Elden Ring. And no spoilers, no mechanics, no uh early access, no YouTube, nothing. And that was definitely the way to go. Drinking the way to go. Paid for in blood. A lot of souls. Uh oh dear God. Thank you for the seven months. Thank you, oh dear God. Uh alright, so to strengthen the spear, I need five more smithing stones. And I only have one. Damn. I thought I had more. Actually thought I had more. So I cannot do that anymore. Are my swords better? Uh, can you play co-op if you have friends? I don't know if this game has. Does this? I think this game has some kind of multiplayer and co-op. Apparently, I do not have the right stones. Probably because I'm in an area I shouldn't be. Would be probably my guess. So I have, like, the wrong stuff. Plus, you got a ton of them. I think I've got the wrong stones. I think. Uh, let's take a look at my flasks. Okay, so we got another ch uh, ch uh, flask charge. So that's good. Uh, all right, we can level up some stats. Are we all in on decks here, I guess? All in decks. Let's grab decks and bigger. 
No horses and co-op. You have so much you can do it again. Yeah, I have a fuckload of stones that I don't necessarily need. Okay, so we leveled up a bunch. Uh, we used all my extra extra souls that we had. Uh, we found that boss that ate my ass. Uh, it wasn't as bad as you might think, but he definitely ate my ass. Um, all right, let's go back here, and we want to go there. We'll have to go back. We'll try to go back. That boss definitely did seem doable. It seemed like it was doable, but let's continue going. Maybe we can find some more upgrade materials. Perhaps we shouldn't be too focused on doing that right now, right? All right, let's go uh, south. We're going this way because we haven't really been this way much. Back on the surface. It'd be a bit of a grind, yeah. I'm, I'm, with so much open to me, it feels weird to grind. You know, like there's so many things. Kind of feel like grinding would be an odd choice right now. Uh, I am currently playing on PC. Whoops. Currently playing on PC. Thank you, oh dear God. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? There's no way, there's no way the bitrate didn't tank on that one. I'm seeing these moments where there's so much shit on the screen that there's like no way. Hit his dick. Hey! 
Great Enemy Feld. Dragonheart. A new draconic power is available at the Cathedral of Dragon Communion. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> uh, okay. Damn, son. What a game. Uh, there's something behind here. What a game. Already, already, all I can say is what a game. I think that not every boss... Not every boss in this game is going to be created equal. I think there's just definitely going to be some bosses that are like... I don't want to say a letdown, but like they're going to be not... Not every boss is going to be of the same like holy shit levels. You know? But... Uh, Jester, thank you so much for the 24 months. Thank you, Jester. Dragon Burnt Ruins. Wait, I just killed Agil. These guys are talking about Agil, but I just killed him. I am your new god. We were, uh, we already went in here, right? We were already in this pit. Okay, I keep, I always do that. I Every time I go around in this area, I always get distracted. All right, let's keep going south and east. Is, are you ever gonna let me attack? Good Lord, oh my God, how many of these fucking dogs are there? Uh, Samurai 7, thank you very much for the resub. Thank you, Samurai 7. <laughs> God, I didn't want... I don't really want to fight that guy. Uh, 7 Samurai is one of my all-time favorite movies. The jumping seems less awkward than expected. Uh, I mean, I think your major jumping actually, whoa, what in the fuck? Cool hat, man. <laughs> you must be the new tarnished. Beautiful work. Felling that dragon and as such, there's something you might like to know. The heart you brought back. It's used in dragon communion. If you should find yourself overcome by hunger for the heart, yearning for its strength, then seek the decrepit church on the little island off the western coast. So this guy is telling me a little island off the western coast. And that's what you do with the dragon heart, but... Phew, fucking A. You know, Lord only knows. Where's Fat Albert? Uh, Specsifier. I'm sorry. I might have missed your sub. Thank you for the 10 months. Thank you, Specsifier. I'm really sorry if I missed your sub. Thank you, Jester. Thank you guys so much. Hope you guys have enjoyed the... Whoa, there's like a whole battle going on here. Whole ass battle going on. These guys are dropping smithing stones. I'm all about it. These are like fat people. I thought I was backstabbed. Hey, 
Hey, uh, so killing these guys seems to give me more smithing stones, which is what we really, really want. We want those. Uh, what do the rainbow stones do? What are these? Uh, oh, okay. So these are like prism stones from Dark Souls. Okay, you leave them and they, they give you a guide. Okay, got you. Okay, so maybe killing all these human guys for smithing stones is like the play. Get more smithing stones from all that. It's sure so long. Sorry, Dark Souls Internet was being shitty earlier. This is awesome. Yeah, I mean, you know, shit happens. I'm not going to get too upset about it. Uh, it was definitely frustrating, especially after they tell you they fixed your internet and it's, it's not fixed. That's always annoying. How the fuck are we going to get over there? Is there like a, a land bridge or something? How many hours in this game? Uh, what time do we start playing? Six or something? Four, uh, four, no, it wasn't six. It was like 4.30ish, around 4.30. Yeah, where's my Breath of the Wild glider? Yeah, it was around 4.30. So that means we've been playing about six-ish hours. Oh, wait, no, uh, five-ish hours? That's eh, something like that. It's just melting time. Uh... Oh, we found a... Oh, we got a new weapon, a falchion? Drop the falchion. Cool. So they come out of the ground and attack you. Interesting. Okay. Where is Wind Waker? He was circle strafing me. He was, yeah. <laughs> he was. Um... What's down here? You're probably going to ask me, but uh, if so, Bammy, how would a newcomer to the Souls games fare with Elden Ring? Probably about as well as you do with any of the other games. Uh, it would probably look not unlike what's happening with me right now, where I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing, and you just kind of bounce from one thing to the next. But what, when you're bouncing from one thing to the next and you're picking stuff up and you're going, what you're not realizing is that you actually are getting better because you're picking up new items and stuff. So like uh, I've picked up a bunch of smithing materials. We found new areas. We killed that dragon boss. So I think what you, if you're, especially if you're stuck in this game, like I'm not, first of all, let me, let me preface this by saying I'm not an expert at this game. I only just started playing it a couple, a little while ago. But I think if you're stuck in this game really hard, maybe try going somewhere else. Maybe try exploring. And I think that's what the game is kind of made for. You know. Keep looking around. Keep exploring. Find some new areas to go to. Did I haven't found a, uh, a thing, uh, like a bonfire thing anywhere. I haven't found one in a while, dude. Am I a Jod Jamer here too? Oh, I have had a couple moments where I, I, I've done okay. The the guy at the castle gate is kicking has kicked my ass repeatedly. He has repeatedly kicked my ass. You picked up anything as far as the story? Uh, I gotta be honest, I can't really tell you what's going on in the story. I guess for the story, I would say so far there was a ring. Uh, it was shattered. The shattering of the ring shattered the peace of the land and all these different people are claiming pieces of the ring. And with those pieces of the ring, they have this crazy power or whatever. Something like that. Um, but once again, like, you're asking, you know. Whoa. 
What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Here, you deal with it. Or you can just fuck right off with that. Ah. <laughs> uh. Man bear pig? It might have been. It might have been fucking shit, dude. Everywhere I want to go just wants to kick my ass. Really? I was just kind of hoping I would find one of those realm things. I, I just wanted to sit down somewhere. I can't find one. <laughs> Where are we? Oh, who got I In this entire area, I haven't found even one, dude. Yeah, yeah. I just want to find one. I, I, I think... Can, you, can I fast travel at any time? I can. I guess I could fast travel. This uh, grave site over here. These are pretty nice for gaining a bunch of a bunch of soul items here. I like these. Okay. Did the wolf just hip check me? The dogs look much slower. We we saw those things underground, these like giant ball things. Oh man, you like how fast stamina, dude? Get, this game gives you a shitload of stamina to start with, a lot of stamina when you start, and your stamina comes back very quickly. I think uh, that's gonna be something that's weird to adjust to compared to a Souls game. boat to Dragon Island. I'm beginning to think I should fast travel, especially with the amount of souls I have. I would like... To, I don't want to lose these. I'd like to spend them. And every direction I seem to be going seems to take me farther and farther into danger. There's like a cast... Check it out. There's like a castle here that's like killing dudes. So it's, it, it seems like the bat dudes, the bat people, are fighting the humans for whatever reason. Oh, welcome, dear customer. Yes, right this way. Welcome, Bali, please. I'm hungry. All right, what do you got? A hand axe, uh, a blue shield, a riveting shield, expands crafting repertoire. These are expensive. Uh, I don't really want to do these. Can I sell? All right. Yeah, I don't know. I don't really know what I want to buy, if anything. Buy the lump. Okay, let's go back here real quick. Let's go back here. Uh, what's up, Andy? How are the old rings? Uh, this game is pretty fucking crazy, man. It's pretty crazy so far. It is, uh, it's wild. Uh, I'm very close to leveling up. Uh, is this game worth it so far? Oh, absolutely. Uh, I would definitely say so. I mean, I haven't finished it yet, so keep that in mind. Um, 
But yeah, this game is super, super worth it. You teleported the upper right too. What a dick move that was. Yeah, yeah. That was definitely a thing. Is it living up to the hype? I think so, yeah. I, so far, I think so. Uh, John Jarvis. Thank you for the 50 gift subs. Holy crap. Thank you so much, John Jarvis. I really, really appreciate that. John Jarvis, thank you so much. Uh, that's nuts, dude. Thank you. Can I talk to you? What do you want? Uh, so that's all they said. What do you want? Okay. Uh, what, do you what do you mean a house guest? Uh, John Jarvis, thank you very, very much. I really, really appreciate that. Thank you, John Jarvis. Stand beneath those words, help. Follow the guidance of grace. Do so, and the doors to the rounds and you will receive. Okay. Like, bring a great rune and stand before the thing and do that, and you can see the two finger. Okay. Thine Ogre, thank you for the 18 months. Thank you very much. Did I get any shards to thing to upgrade my spear? Did I get any shards for the spear? Okay, here's the blacksmith. I got a couple. I don't think I have enough, though. We need three more uh, for the spear. Okay. I did get a key. Is the key thing in here? Is it somewhere in here? I don't remember. I don't remember where it is. Uh, pretty lost. Downstairs? Basement? Have I gotten any more ashes of war? Try the flail. I don't have enough decks, dude. I need 18 decks. Oh, I have 19 decks. <laughs> I have 19 decks. Uh, so it looks like the flail currently does less damage. It causes blood loss buildup, though. Check it out. It causes it causes bleed. That's cool. So it's like it kind of reminds me. Maybe it's slightly like. The uh, spiked club from Dark Souls. Maybe, maybe a little bit like that causes bleed. Uh, ha ha manners. Thank you so much for the four months. Oh, do we? Oh, you know what? This one needs two. Check it out. This one also needs two. <sighs> Can you upgrade it? Okay, here's the thing. I want to go back to Dickhead. Let's go back and fight Dickhead. But there was a bunch of human enemies right before Dickhead. And I want to go... So we're going to go here. I'm going to go backwards because the human enemies seem like they drop the stone shards. So uh, we, want to we want to deal with them. Can I have coffee? Thank you. Like this way. Oh, you guys want me to try the flail? Here, let's try the flail. Dude, I backstab them with the flail. Swinging a chain, swinging a chain. <laughs> oh man. What's my take on on Elden Ring so far? I think it's 
pretty good. Hmm? Can I use the shield on my back? Yeah, yeah. So all I have to do is do this, and now I can use the shield and block and stuff. I like the flail. See that that's why I want to do these because these guys these guys drop smithing stones. That's why I kinda wanted to fight these guys. I could use some more smithing stones. Check out this guy's got the fucking Zweihander. Look at this shit. Have I beaten Fuckface? No, not yet. I got super distracted. I I've, I've been I've been all over. Dude, check out when I charge up the R2. I got like Omega distracted. I went like way elsewhere. Wild strikes. Okay, so that's a weapon art that we can use to learn wild strikes on stuff. That's what that is. That was the bleed just took over. I'll try to work in more uh, jumping attacks. Right you are, Gilbert. Uh, thank you very much. Fino Fox. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. The only thing that sucks is that if I want to switch to this weapon, it's going to cost me a lot of uh, souls. Well, it's going to cost me a lot of the upgrade materials, which I could use to put it on the spear. You lonely boy. Uh, were we over here? Where? Hey, that's my. Are you drinking my water? Oh, I got now. I got cat water. Great. Now I got stinky cat water. Excuse you. Hey, c come on. Go on. Hey, your rat is out of control. <laughs> oh, you can just jump on those. More golden runes. Uh, I haven't killed one of these guys yet, man. <laughs> oh, boy. It was like, yeah, yeah, that's enough. I think I've had enough. My turn.
That bleed damage is nice. Okay, we killed the giant. That guy give me like a thousand souls. Cool. What do we got? Lord soul. Lord vessel. Strength not crystal tear. What is that? What is that? Where would that be? What is that thing? I don't know. Strength not. Temporary boost strength in mixed physic. Oh, so I could combine these two for like a special potion. Thank you, baby. You going to bed soon? Okay. We try the flail. I uh, yeah, that's what I'm. I'm using the flail right now. It seems like the flail is pretty pog. It looks like it causes a uh, bleed, which is pretty nice. I'm liking it. Yeah, I feel like I like it better than the uh, than the spear. Right. We need more stones, though. We don't have a lot of. I haven't found a way to reliably get stones. Haven't found a way to do it. I can get stones, but I have. Oh. Uh, oh boy. You prick. You don't hit nearly as hard as the last one, though. I like the, the bleed buildup is where the damage really takes off. Okay. Use Duelist Furled Fingers to write a red su uh, summon sign. Competitive multiplayer will begin once you have begun uh, summoned by a player from another world. Okay. Why will this door not open? So this seems like some kind of duelist arena or something, maybe. Okay. Elden Ring Esports. More fire slugs over here. Uh, have you tried getting stone, Barb? Uh, I see a thing up top. Oh boy. Okay, I think we're gonna dismount to fight this fucking guy. Okay. Ash of War Golden Vow. Huh. Was that the move he was casting in the sky? Like he was casting Golden Vow in the sky or something? Is that what he was doing? It looked like it. Somber. I don't know what a somber smithing stone is. I don't know what that is. Have you figured out crafting yet? I don't know how to craft a fucking thing. I haven't figured it out. <laughs> I haven't figured out a fucking thing how to craft. Maybe it's like a twinkling. Yeah, maybe for specific weapons or something. Kind of want to try the flail against dickhead over here and see how it does. 
It's like a smithing stone, but sad. Oh, now it makes sense. I feel like there's got to be a place to like buy the stones or something, right? Like there's got to be a way you can just like go buy them or something. I don't know. Maybe like the right vendor. Crafting it for the merchant, you can actually craft weapons. Uh, maybe. Oh. Ow, you hurt. You really hurt. You win. We got another smithing stone. That's good. That's what we're looking for. God damn, dude. God damn it. Love it. Helicopter dick. How many spending stones do we have now? We have uh, five. We can probably upgrade the flail a little bit. Maybe we could upgrade it like twice. All right. That means it would be on par on par with the thing. All right, let's go try to power up the flail. All right. Yep. All right. All that work, no stones. We got a couple of stones. Try the attack after blocking. I should. I should try that. I, it's, it's hard to wrap your mind around all these new mechanics and new things like block then attack and stuff. It's hard to keep it all straight. I will do my best. Can you dismantle? I don't think so. Took you no matter, it's out your Alright, uh, strengthen armament. So we can strengthen the flail to only to plus one. We need one more stone. One more stone is all we would need. Uh, smithing stone. We also have this falchion. I haven't tried the falchion either. It shows you that stuff first, which is cool. It'd be cool if you could dismantle. This is a hub. Yeah, this is kind of like a hub area, kind of like in Bloodborne, Dark Souls 3, um, kind of like that. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go fight. Oh, can I can I actually level up here? Is it? Uh, we're very close. Hang on. Maybe we can go. We can probably level up one more time. Maybe not. Uh, if we only need one more stone, we could probably, and we're so close to leveling up. Let's go travel one more time. Back here. Uh, get one more stone before dickhead. I know I want one more stone. I do. Uh, what's the death counter at? I've died a lot. I especially died a lot to the fucking arrow guys in the underground cave. Those guys are insane. Oh my God, those guys are fucking insane. Okay. Uh, don't mind if I do. Thank you for 11 months. Thank you. Don't mind if I do. Appreciate it. Her magic is actually great in this. Yeah, I, dude, I, I feel like it would be amazing to experiment with magic. I'm all about it. Sure. All about it.
Okay. Oh, fuck. Ah. Smack the Vuvuzela, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Just getting my fucking ass wrecked. Just getting fucking destroyed right now. Don't worry. Some enemies just keep swinging, man. They just keep swinging. They got dark. They got a bad case of Dark Souls 3 where they just keep swimming. Any invasions yet? Well, I think I'm playing offline. So I don't think invasions are something I have to worry about. Oh, I've been invaded by NPCs. Yeah, that has happened. Jeez. Did I miss a material around here somewhere? I don't think I got a single material, did I? Does your roll change with your weight? Uh, yes, it does. Some fries, motherfucker. I see you're well be clothed now. Yeah, we have clothes now. <laughs> no longer naked idiot. Maybe, uh, maybe choosing, uh, the wretch in this game was not the best idea. But, oh, I'm having a great time. I don't care. So yeah, I kind of can't find any, uh, I can't find any more stones, I guess. Can't find them. Rip barb cheeks. Because you're living in a material world. I am a material girl. Okay, we got a surcoat. Man, not getting any uh, stones. You picked up a new shield too. Uh, let's see, physical. This one actually is a little bit better for armor, it seems, this new surcoat. Also pretty styling looking, I like it. <laughs> 